Hey guys, it's Louise here and welcome back to my channel. So today we have episode 6 of The Rings of Power and I am very excited. Uh, the, the, the crew have just left uh, Numenor um, and they're heading back to Middle Earth. Um, I'm very excited. Uh, I think it's gonna, like the episodes have already been crazy so far, but I think it's gonna like ramp it up from like 100 to like 200. Like I think it's about to go down and I am looking very much, I'm very much looking forward to it. So let's just get straight into it. Where did everybody go? And they were probably expecting like a shit ton of people and then they get here and there's just nobody. Heck. <laughs> get fucked. Ooh, fire arrows! You love to see it. Oh. Okay. Okay. I see you. Oh my god! Arendir is really making his way up my favorite character list of all time. Like, him and Legolas as a team up, I need to see it happen. The whole horse thing just runs in the family, doesn't it? Fuck, that's wholesome! He's sharing his apple with the horse! It is quite literally a family thing. I love him. Dude, he is stunned. He has the same look that he had when he first saw Galadriel step, like, step onto the ship. Oh god, I love him. I hate it. I hate that I'm I'm falling in love with Isildur. Ugh. Yeah, that thing can probably want to be destroyed by throwing it into the lava, my dude. It's beyond us, Kira. God, I have a really bad feeling. I really hope she's not gonna die. But I've got a really bad feeling about this. Remember when I was little? In the end, this shadow is but a small and passing thing. God, I feel like she's not gonna make it after that fucking speech. Oh my god. Ugh, stop! Are we finally gonna get the kiss? Finally? Ah, so cute! Oh my god! But I really hope this doesn't end in disaster, but I... I know it will. Something's gonna end in disaster. Ah, you... motherfucker! Oh lord. Oh, Jesus Christ! Shit, damn girl! Why are the orcs not noticing this already? I mean... <laughs> Never underestimate a woman or an elf, basically. Oh god, this is gonna go terribly. Ugh. Oh. oh god, he's a fucking big boy. Jesus. Oh, that was a spicy move. There's no way they'd kill Iron Deer off, right? There's no way. Surely. Somebody help him! Oh. <laughs> lightheaded after that, Jesus Christ. 
And this is where the real shit starts. Oh no! I'm literally shaking. I can't deal with this. Oh, thank God. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh my God, this is a fucking dark episode. Oh shit. Oh dude, that horse armor is sick. Are we about to save the day? You better make those horses go at the speed of light. But I hate that he's hot. God damn it, why can they make Adar ugly? The woman next. Wait! It's under here. I mean, to be fair, it was for his mother. I would, we would all do the exact same thing. You can't lie. <gasps> They're here! Holy shit! Oh my god, we're gonna have Galadriel. And we're gonna have Arendir fighting them together. Holy shit, this is insane. Oh my god, wow. Yes, let's go, queen! Holy fuck! Oh! Yes, use those sword skills! Let's go! Nice! Oh, gross. It's not Lord of the Rings unless an orc falls on you. Go get him, Galadriel! <laughs> He's like, never seen anything more beautiful in his life. Oh! God damn! But every time anyone sees her, they're just like in shock. Oh my god. The speedy, speedy horses. Holy fuck. Palabran's at the back, like, get up for me, please! Oh! They flanked him! Okay, well, he didn't kill the horse, so that's nice. Oh no, don't let him have it. Don't let him have it. Don't. Oh! Oh! We need to move high. I killed Sauron. I do not believe you. You definitely did not kill Sauron. It would seem I'm not the only elf alive. It's been transformed by. I absolutely love Halbrand's armor. It looks so nice. Fighting at your side, I, if I could just hold on to that feeling, keep it with me always. These two need to stay besties forever. Find it in my very being. Oh man, that is a beautiful shot. Oh my God, the tension! Oh my God. I cut it with a butter knife. King Halbrand. I'm here for it. Yay! Not the same, but it works. I love seeing him smile. I love seeing everybody smile. Should you really be trusting him with this? <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> oh, I thought like Galadriel or someone would have hidden it. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, Jesus. Why 
wouldn't you check it before? See, it runs in the family. Oh, I love them both so much. Oh my lord! Holy fuck! Dude, that's insane. Where are you supposed to take shelter? That's fucking beautiful, but it's also fucking terrifying. Oh, he's gone. Can't just leave it on that. I need next week's episode now. What the fuck? No, that's not okay. I'm gonna need like I'm gonna need a lot of time to process what the fuck just happened. I I oh what the fuck? Oh god. You know I feel like I need to start doing one of the reactors like blind wave and stuff. Do I need to get like a notebook and I need to start writing shit down? Not that I'd remember to write shit down anyway because I'd be too busy like focused on the episode because. My brain can't process things very well, but I can't remember. I need I need time to remember and think. I need to know what I need to speak about. That was a fucking masterpiece. That whole like shot at the end with Mount Doom fucking erupting. Holy fucking shit! That is absolutely mm, chef's kiss. Beautiful, wonderful. Not a good thing, but it's fucking beautiful. This show has gone above and beyond. I don't care what anyone says. It is above and beyond. Um. I am now so fucked. Like, that entire episode had me so tensed up. Like, I I, I feel like I barely spoke. I barely made any commentary because I was just so stunned that everything was happening. Like, everything was either just scary, intimidating, beautiful, like, wholesome. There was wholesome moments in there, like Isildur and Elendil. Like, that was so fucking cute. And then when everything was erupting and then Isildur was looking for his horse. And like I said, it's a family thing. And... Oh my goodness, and, you know, Galadriel was a fucking boss-ass bitch. She was so cool. Um, and seeing her with the horse as well, it kind of reminds you of Arwen with her horse and, you know, this speedy, uh, you know, the words that they say and they all go all, like, speedy and stuff. It was really, really beautiful. Um, I, I do think Elendil's speech about the horse as well was just, it, it tugged my heartstrings. Um... Aaron Deer is a fucking oh my god. There's just no words in the dictionary to describe just how fucking cool he is. Like you, you see, you see some of the things that Legolas does, and some of the stuff that Galadriel even did in that episode. But Aaron Deer is just like he's just like a step up. Like he's there's just something about him. I don't know. He's just oh, they really, really gave us such a good character with him. Um. I, f I fucking- they, they should have killed that man. That man should have been fucking god in the first episode. The, I don't know his name, the man that had the, 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 the sword. Uh, fucking idiot, man. Fucking idiot. I hope something bad happens. I hope he gets karma. Um, but they should have checked. Like, are they- are they- are they dumb? Like, like, wouldn't you check what's inside? To make sure what it is? Like, at least Theo has a brain. Like, first of all, Theo- is the one who handed it over. Uh, I mean, well, maybe that's not a good thing. Okay, maybe, yeah, maybe that's probably the problem. But, I mean, everyone would have died if he didn't. So, I mean, technically, in the long run, he did the good thing by handing it over, saved his mom, saved everyone, and everyone else came in. But then, they should have checked it. He was smart enough to check it. Um, but, like, do elves not sense that kind of thing? Like, I know they have their elf ears and their elf smell and their elf eyes, but do they not have, like, an elf sense that they know that there's something evil in there? I don't know. I, I don't know how it works, but I just... Oh, it's chaos. I was like, chaos. Um, God, my brain is going in a million miles an hour. I, I need to rewatch that episode again. Oh my god, I'm just... Oh, I do... I will admit, of course, as always, I miss Elrond. I miss... I miss Durin. But that's okay, because they're safe. 
for for now. They're safe at the minute. Um, but oh my god, that was insane. That oh, and Halbrand, the new king, the most beautiful king. I love him. Absolutely love him. Um, I still do have a bit like I do have a little bit of fear about him. Like I feel like it's we're not seeing everything that we that we think we're seeing. Uh, I feel like there's something else behind it or something that's gonna happen. Um, but for now, I'm gonna enjoy and appreciate him and love him. Um, I am completely obsessed with him. Um, Adar, no idea where the fuck he's gone. Uh, but that's kind of scary that he's just disappeared. Like, where the fuck is he? Gal Galadriel should have killed him. Like, yeah, get the fuck rid of him. Not that I want him to die because he's beautiful, but also get rid of him. Um... That, the, the, oh god, I don't even know what else to say at this point. Like I said, I need a fucking notebook. I need to write shit down so I remember what to talk about and what to say and what's on my mind. I I do really like uh, Adar's like sort of little backstory about the Uruk and stuff. Um, and with how just straight up brutal and uh sort of just ruthless he was when he was speaking to Galadriel, like about like oh you should have just you know ended it when you looked in a mirror or whatever the hell he said. Like, that would fucking... That probably cut deep. Um, and then Halbrand being like, you know, do you remember me? And he's like, no. Like, fuck. Uh, that... Oh, God. I, if I was if I was Halbrand, I wouldn't be able to keep control. I would have fucking stabbed the bitch. But obviously, that is not the last that we're going to see of uh, Adar. Um... Again, I still don't really know where we're going. I don't know. I mean, motherfucker was like, oh, yeah, I killed Sauron. Yeah, okay, buddy. I'm sure you did. Um, I don't know. I, I don't really know what that's... If that's, like, a, a like a reference to something or what is... I like, I, I don't really know what, what's going to come of that. But, um, yeah, it was the, just an insane episode, man. I'm absolutely in love with this show. I am obsessed, and that was just the most beautiful episode. That was the greatest episode so far. Um, like everything was just going so nice at the end. Um, and then of course, I mean, it's Lord of the Rings. Obviously, it's gonna fuck up. Um, but yeah, that's that's it. I'm not really excited for next week. I just want to sleep. I want to sleep and hibernate until next week, because I'm not gonna stop thinking about it. Um. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Let me know what you think. Um, if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe for more Lord of the Rings and mostly Star Wars content. Um, and yeah, thank you guys for watching. I will see you in the next video. So peace.